Hello everyone, this is Sai Damul Varnwal. Welcome to the Sales for CPQ channel. This is my the part 3 Sales for CPQ tips and tricks. Let me navigate to my next slide deck. Okay, so today I am going to discuss about how to default the primary contact lookup on the Sales for CPQ code. As you see my screen, on this code number 00044, you will see the primary contact get auto populated from opportunities primary contact contact role. How you can achieve this particular requirement? Let me navigate to my next slide deck. These are all steps that you have to follow. Okay. Now what you have to do, you will have to create You will have to create a primary contact, code primary contact, a lookup to the contact field on an opportunity. The moment you have created this opportunities field name called code primary contact, which is basically a lookup to the contact, and you have saved it, and any user or any sales ref, if they are adding any primary contact role under the opportunity, what Salesforce CPQ will transform? Salesforce CPQ engine will automatically take care of this default primary contact lookup on the code record. Let's navigate to the actual demo. This is one of my org where I'm going to create this field name called code primary contact, which is basically a, a contact lookup on opportunity. Just click on setup, navigate to the object manager, go to the opportunity, search for the opportunity, click on field and relationship, click on new, select the lookup relationship data type, click on next. Search for the lookup name, lookup object called contact. Click on next. Change the field name and API name to the code primary contact. And please make sure do not have any space in the field name. Click on next. Mark it visible. Click on next. Add to the layout or whatever you want. Click on next. Do not add to the related list. It is not being needed. Click on save. That's it. Let me give you the demo how it works. I am going to open one of my account name called Edge Communication. In this Edge Communication, you will see I have two contacts. I have seen Forbes and Rows. This row is my SVP procurement team who is going to purchase a product from my organization. I am going to create a new opportunity for edge communication. After creating this opportunity, what you have to do, you'll have to add the contact role and mark their contact as a primary. Let me add a contact role under this opportunity while clicking on an contract from the related list. Select roles as a contact, as a primary contact and click on next. Put this role as decision maker or any other role whatever you want click on save after creating and adding this primary this contact role what you have to do you will have to mark this contact as a primary click on edit and this mark as a primary contact role under the opportunity that's it now let's create a new code record 
for this opportunity of edge communication. And the moment you navigate to the code, you will see the by default, my primary contact, which is Rose, get auto-populated with help of this Salesforce CPQ engine automatically. Thank you. These are all my personal detail, my email IDs, my LinkedIn profile, my blog post, as well as my YouTube and Twitter channel. Thanks for joining my session. Have a great day ahead.